What do you guys think? It's okay, I'll wait. Lights off or lights on? Lights off. Lights off. Hello. Hi. Actually just got back from work and absolutely going to ignore the fact that I haven't uploaded a video in like almost a year yes moving past that anyways um, I haven't showered I am just going to clean my face with a makeup remover so yeah, I'm just going to clean my face with a micellar water makeup remover. Uh, I'm using Warda. So I'm just going to clean the dirt and oils off my face like so. I think I should look there, but I cannot. I didn't even tell you guys what I'm going to do today. <laughs> so yes, that is face cleaned. I have a pimple coming up on my nose. If you followed me on Instagram, you would know that I said I'll be making a video about creating a makeup look for Raya. So here I am. Kalau aku sempat edit lah. Kalau aku habis edit. Kalau tak habis, tak tadi lah. Like any other time that I said I was going to do a video, but then I didn't. So yeah. And moving on. So next, I'll be toning my face with um, Ali the tree toner. Eh, it's good. It's okay. I like how it feels on my skin. It gets the job done. People think I know a lot of stuff about skincare, but I don't. I know absolutely nothing about skincare. I just have been given the opportunity, the chance to try out these um, um, products. Some of them are affordable, some of them are high-end. And I'm, I'm grateful for the experience. Saya terima saja dengan hati yang terbuka. Gitu. Next, I'll be using this lotion by Hadalapu. And I like it. I like how it feels on my skin. So should I or should I not get into the fact that I haven't been posting anything on my YouTube channel and how I've been very inactive on like all of my social medias? We? Should we get into that? Do you even want to know? Do you even care? But, um, I don't know. Things happen. You know, people have their ups and downs, and I've been having mine since last year. <laughs> Moving on to serum. This is also from Hadalabo. So, yeah. Why I haven't been posting anything at all. I don't know. I feel like I've lost interest in everything. You know what I mean? You get me? If you have been following me on my Instagram or any of my social medias for a long time now, you would know that I used to go spam my Instagram stories like a lot. And I and I enjoy doing it. I like to entertain my followers, I guess, the ones who have followed me. You guys you guys know right what I usually post when I do post my stories be just like random stuff I attempt to make people laugh I'm using this because I feel like you know humor is subjective not everyone would find what I post what I do entertaining as I claimed it today but some but some people say have told me that I um, I am entertaining I made their day by posting and um, when um, I get those kind of DMs, I feel warm and fuzzy inside. <laughs> Cringe, but it's true. You might have noticed I spent a lot of time on my face. I mean, with the serum, I mean. I'm just waiting for it to be like completely absorbed into my skin before completely moving on to the final step, which is my moisturizer. Currently, I'm using Skintific, the five times ceramide. Barrier Repair Moisture Gel, it's really good. It's only 33 ringgit, guys. 
invest in good skincare. Use it. I'm using only this little amount and put it there. <clears throat> I'm really bad at explaining stuff. As you can tell, my story. The details are everywhere. All is all over the place. I can't speak. See, I completely forgot what I talked about. What I was talking about. I'm just going to let the skincare products set before um, moving on to the makeup. Starting with foundation, I'm using Camellia Cosmetics Mermaid Skin Flawless Filter Foundation. I am in the shade Prolin. Prolin, as you can see. Um, yes. I'm just going to put some here. It's tiny bits of amount, and then I'm going to use my finger and just apply dots onto my skin. You know what? I'm not gonna get into. I'm not gonna give you guys like a sob story of why I haven't been posting or why I haven't like been myself, I guess. I don't think people actually wanna hear it, but whatever. Oh, okay, after I like put dots all over my face, I'm going to- sorry, what was that? I'm going to actually spread it like this. I spread it evenly. And then blend. I forgot to do it. It's blend. Blend it into your skin. You know what? I'm just gonna say it. <laughs> the reason why I haven't been posting or whatever is because I've lost interest in a lot of stuff. I've been very, very sad. I've been just... I don't know. I've just been really upset about things. I haven't been feeling like myself. It's, it's kind of cliche to say this, but I felt like I've lost a part of myself, a big part of myself, um, to be exact. I don't know what happened exactly. I can't like actually pinpoint like where it went wrong, but it happened. Like in the year 2021, or is it, or is it 2020? Um, somewhere between those years. Oh, you know what? It's the beginning of the pandemic. That's where when things just go to, things just went like down. I guess it's, it was just a shit show. I didn't. I didn't want to admit that this thing, the things that were happening in my life at the time, is affecting me and how it actually changed me as a person. But it did. It did. I realized that now. <laughs> it took me that long to actually like fully really acknowledge. That was the reason why I've changed. I won't say that I've changed for worse or I've changed for the better. My close friends would know that I've definitely changed a lot, like drastically. In terms of like, I reply to texts late or n never reply at all. Or I just don't respond much, like the way I used to. I don't know. Things just happen. I'm not gonna go like into that much of a detail, but things happen. I got sad because of the things that happened. I didn't know how to handle it, how to overcome it, how to um, move in that, in whatever that was happening. Like I don't know how to. I, I just don't know. I lost a couple people in my life and it was hard it was hard letting go and i guess i just didn't know how to handle that i still try to post you know i still try to like engage with you guys with you guys especially on instagram but it wasn't as much out as, as it was before so yeah foundation is done next is concealer this is by silky girl uh fix it liquid concealer in the shade light 01 just going to put it under my under eyes like very lightly lightly so I do it like this why um because I've been told that this would lift the shape of your face I guess when I say I don't know anything about makeup I don't know I don't know what things do just going to let that kering sikit sikit lah but not too kering some of you have been asking me before like and to be honest, I did feel bad because I didn't post as much 
you guys follow me because I do those stuff because I post those stories you guys follow me there because I do those things you know but then I suddenly don't post stuff and then you don't get what you expect from following me I just felt like uh, um, that was that was just bad on my part you know I should be out there I should be posting more I should be um, creating content for you for the people who follow me because that's why you follow me and I get that but at the same time, um, I just couldn't. I don't have the energy to. I had, I had like I thought where I shouldn't feel like I am obligated to post for other people because because it's like it's like you guys, the viewers, right? You guys have your own Instagram. You guys have your own social medias and stuff. It's like when you you post because you want to. You don't post because you don't feel like posting. It's like that for me. I feel like. I'm just like other people. I'm just a person. I'm just like you guys. I feel like I don't have to feel like I am obligated to do something because of other people, you know what I mean? So yeah, it dawned on me. Therefore, here I am. <laughs> I'm only posting when I want to. That's my justification of, what, of not posting as much. So now I'm going to blend it in. I feel like I left it on too long. Don't get me wrong though, I like what I do. I like creating content. I love editing videos on my own accord. <laughs> but there are times when people feel like they're so tired, they just couldn't do anything, even like the simplest task. That's just how I felt. That's just how I've been feeling, I guess. Okay, I think it blended real nicely. Next is powder. I'm using the Limo, Limo OC oil free setting powder. This one is really cheap, by the way. Set it under my eyes. Powder ni kita tak powder so that dia tak terlalu macam oily or shiny. Kan kita berpeluh kat bagian sini. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at that. You see the difference? Sini ni macam nampak shiny sangat and then lepas letak powder dia macam oh, smooth. Lovely, it's lovely. You see that? Gorgeous. I letak kat sini juga sebab sini I selalu like berminyak kat bahagian sini. And my forehead as well. Tak sikit. Just gonna do like light powder je kot. I tak like do, I tak buat like baking you know. Yang yang letak powder kat sini tu. I'm not gonna do that because who has the time? Who has the time for you you know? Especially if you have like a big family like mine And then bedroom ada satu je So yeah, tak sempat babe, tak sempat Okay, powder dah You see, macam Like muka you macam Oh yes macam, It's like, oh yes Next would be blush Today I'll be using this one I don't remember what I, where I bought this But I think it's from the Moosi juga But I'll, I'll put the link in the description box for you guys to see Dia orang ada begini I'm not gonna be using it. If you did a brush, I'm just going to show you how to apply it with your fingers. So, actually I haven't like swatched it yet. I don't know how this will look. This is the color. It's quite pigmented for a product yang cheap. You know what I mean? I'm going to put it um, here. Okay, you don't know here. Blend it like that. So this is how it looks like the color on my skin. I nak tambah sikit lagi pakai um, brush this time. That's cute. Okay, it's quite it's really pigmented. I'm impressed. And then I'm just going to blend it in. So it's merah Rather than my nose here. I also could emphasize the blush like on my like the 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 what do you call this one? Um your your I forgot the bridge, the bridge of the nose. I also could emphasize the Gazini. That's just me, but you can also do on like the button of your nose. And then I'm sure you already know this, but you can also use your blush for your eyeshadow. This one in case you not bought my like pinkish look. 
you can just use the excess blush on your um, brush and drag it on your eyelids like so Okay, pick up your fingers and just apply it like that See? And then you blend it out Like so I also suka letak my blush dekat my dagu and my forehead so that your face doesn't look so flat, you know what I mean? So there's that But if you also want some like shimmer ayat ini It's so pretty This is also from Lemo OC, I think And not at that point This is my first time trying it, by the way I haven't switched Oh, cantik new. How about we use white glitter? Chanti, you see, this one is from this one. It's so pretty. I'm not prepared, by the way, for the video, so I did just wing it right now. Taking this shade and put it like inner corner of your eyes. I don't really see it, but I think there is. I do jump like shimmer skin to the white one and like the inner corner of my eyes, so it will pop. For this one, I'm just going to use my finger. Ah, oh, pretty. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, yeah? Yes! If you not like it extra, um, kita letak shimmer shimmer dekat our waterline. For that, I'll be using this kind of brush. Ik. This color right here. The bit when it do the that guy ever like here that is how it looks like koreko chikona and i i didn't make thing orang na i to along aja macam mana nak buat egg yosal tu kan honestly speaking i put the pandai na boy but i'll try my best to aja so what you do is you ambil macam brown pencil liner Gently, gently draw it along your eye bag, I guess. Like so. Then you blend it in. So did that not put like too much of a harsh line, you know what I mean? So that's that. It might look weird now, but now I'm going to do it with the eyeliner. For a beginner, I recommend you gonna pencil liner because it's much easier to to melukis to pegang rather than a liquid liner. But you want, you know what? Just to see, I'm I'm bad at, at explaining. So what I do is I take here taro ini. Disclaimer: Everyone's uh, eye shape is different, so you do yang mana mak paling sesuai with your eye shape. Okay, after I'm I've done what winged again. I would connect it with my bottom lash, but I would like, um, buggy like space. Would draw it outside of my actual eye shape, and then I would connect it, like so. I really wanted to make like a simple makeup look, but I guess I overdid it. So that's that, and then I'm going to connect it. Um, with the inner corner of my eye. So for my eye shape, so about the like belipat ke hujung ni, I would tarik dia, and then uh, instead of drawing out, I masuk dalam. See the difference. The difference, and then I would tight line it like that. Boring eye, very cool eye. Just going to do the same with the other eye. I think I did it. No, just want to get the bud. Oh, that that's that's as good as it's going to get. So I'm going to use the. Lemo OC Max Volume Super Curl Mascara. This one is my favorite. Darmura. 
Sebab kualiti pula tu This is how it looks like Very cantik ya So I'm going to curl my eyelashes Give it, give it a few squeeze There This is how the wand looks like I'm not gonna talk about the smell Then just apply it like you normally would I don't have like a specific technique on how I apply my mascara This lash memang selalu ugly tau kalau I letak mascara But you guys are gonna see this one and gonna fall in love with me Like immediately fall in love with me There Eyebrows are optional You can just leave it like this Or you can do your eyebrows, whatever you want to do for me, I'm going to do my eyebrows. I recommend you um, to use something like this, like an angular eyebrow pencil. I'm using I'm Uni. What I always do is I would scrunch my eyebrows so that I can get like the initial shape of it. And then I would just fill it in. I would just fill it in, messily fill it in. And then for the inner one, I'm just going to apply it like this Lightly make strokes And then brush it up There Just going to do the next eyebrow Next is also optional But I like to use eyebrow soap For my eyebrows But what you need is a spoolie like this You would want to do this and then just brush it in your eyebrows. I so clear my eyebrows much of me. And then I'm going to add another color, a darker color. This one is from, from Bay Free. not that dark okay this one is from Brina Beauty in the shade Spice Latte give it a gradient look you can just stop here but I'm going to put gloss actually no this is the finished look so this is how it looks like with shawl this is the finished look and yeah, I added another coat um, on my lashes and I put, I put the white eyeshadow on my nose as highlight. So yes, this is how it looks like, but I want to try this lip gloss that I got from Shopee. Put it here. We oh. done the- Oh my god, it's so pretty. It's very oily. But I like how, how it looks on the lips. So yes, that concludes the look. I'm pretty sure no one would want to do this for Ryu, but I wouldn't do it either. So... Because of that, I will make another simple makeup Raya look. I promise. I'm going to up probably upload two videos in a week <gasps> so yes look forward to that inshallah and selamat hari raya <laughs>